All right, we're here live out on the trail with Priel Schmabach. Hey. Okay, Priel, so what, I have one question for you, and it's really what makes you tick? What, what drives you in the morning? What does it? I mean, you're a yoga instructor, MD, PhD student, amazing liver of life, awesome rock climber. So really, what does it for you? Well, uh, I love to have fun, and I love to share my the joy of life with others. Oh. And uh, moments like these that I get to enjoy on a beautiful day with great friends. Oh. Uh, it's it would it's a truly a to uh, bring people to health where they could also enjoy times like this, and so that's where my uh, love of life kind of ties in to making other people healthy and well. That's what it's about. That is beautiful. Prill, can you give us a little tip on how to get that ujjayi breath in yoga? Because I hear ujjayi. you in yoga and you are breathing like a storm, but you're really just getting in that beat, in that, in that rhythm. So you have any tips for beginner yogis to get yeah. that ujjayi? To get the ujjayi sound, you want to be breathing like you're making a sigh. The sigh sounds like this. You hear that? That's how you sound when you sigh. Just try sighing with your mouth open. When you're ready for the ujjayi, close your mouth. Use the same muscles that you use when you sigh and the sound will come through your nose. And uh, that's basically it. Uh, well, there's a lot more to ujjayi in terms of deep breathing, deep, complete, abdominal, thoracic breath, but uh, so you're to really make the, breathing to make out the, the nose, nose to, to make the noise, you gotta engage that musculature that you use in the side on the out breath and the in breath. So are you breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth? Uh, yeah, we are. So in through the nose, out through the mouth. In and out through the nose. In and out through the nose. Yeah. With okay. The okay. Yep. We're going to call it there. All right. Thanks, Priel. Thanks for having me on. Sure.